Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a weekly vlog for you guys. I haven't done one of these in a while and this week I feel like is a little bit more of a chill week, yet I still have some fun activities planned, so I figured it would be a fun vlog to film. Today is Sunday, March 10th. It's currently 8.54 in the morning. You might be wondering, why are you awake at 8.54 in the morning on a Sunday? Which normally I would not be. There's this little like antique fair, kind of like a thrift fair that happens once a month and me and my friends like to go and today it is happening and it starts at like 8 in the morning. It's low-key like 30 minutes away and we don't want to get up too early So we're gonna go at like 9 30 9 45 this morning I am leaving my house in like 10 minutes to go pick up Avery and Nika and us three are gonna go stop at Starbucks first And then go to the antique fair and walk around shop all that fun stuff So that's what I've been getting ready for also today is daylight savings Which I didn't realize until I woke up and my phone didn't match like my actual clock My phone says 8 55 my clock still says 7 55. That's fun But as you guys saw I did my makeup. I did my hair I I used my new little like hair tool that I got for my birthday. I also just added two braids here. I just braided one here and one here. So they're kind of just mixed in to add a little fun touch. For my outfit, I'm wearing this baby tee that I got from Princess Polly. And then I recently got these new jeans from Hollister. They're low waisted. They're a little too like saggy on me, like too big. So I had to tie them in the back, but otherwise they fit perfectly and they're just so cute. For a bag, I think I'm also planning on bringing my Bagu, which is my absolute favorite bag. That completes my look. Like I said, I'm gonna leave my house soon to go pick all my friends up. Hi guys, so I'm back from the antique market. We were actually there for a decent amount of time. It's currently 12.48 p.m. We were there for a few hours and then we stopped at Kane's to get some lunch on our way home. But I'm back now and I wanna give you guys a haul. First off, look at this cute bag. I got this from Bagu, which is also where my like regular shoulder bag is from. This is a Bagu bag. It's my absolute favorite bag. It holds so much. But when I bought it, I also got this little like cute strawberry one that's reusable for like farmer's markets or whatever. Like it folds up into this little pouch so you can bring it anywhere. But I put my purchases in here so let me show you what I got. I got this super cute hanging like succulent plant. It is adorable. First off it has this little like beading thing that it hangs on. It comes in a cute little pink like tin. Then I got a few like prints or like posters. My sister's redoing her room so I let her look at them and decide if she wanted any for her room and she picked one out and so the rest I'm gonna figure out where to put. Here's the first one. This one and then we have this one and then I got this little like hand drawn or like painted little print. It's got like a teddy bear on it. I did get one top. It's pink and it has this teddy bear on it. And then lastly, there's this one stand which you guys saw some footage from, which is a huge jewelry stand. First, I got these gold hoops. They have like a little design on them. I don't know how well you guys can see it. I don't know when I would wear this, but like these little like teeny tiny watches have been popular recently. I got this. I think this is a bracelet, but it's gold and it has these clear little like gems all around it. I thought it was super cute. I also got this little charm bracelet. It has like star fish and like dolphins and stuff on it. It reminds me of the beach. And then I ended up getting a few rings, all gold. I'm a gold jewelry person. I also got this cute little like dish. I thought it would be perfect as like a little jewelry dish to put somewhere. Good morning guys, today is Monday, March 11th. As you guys saw, it's already like 7.20 in the morning. For our school, Mondays are like late start days, so we start like a half an hour later than normal. So instead of starting at 8.30, we start at 9 this morning. Our Monday schedule is also a little bit different, where instead of having like block periods, we have all six of our classes and they're like shorter than the regular block day. Because of that, some people like Monday schedule better because they claim it goes like much faster than a regular block day. But for me, 
I just do not like Mondays. I actually have a decent amount of things that I need to get done this Monday, so it's going to be very productive. What's nice about my schedule is I have a free six period because I'm only taking five classes this year. So when everyone gets out at like 3.15 on Mondays, I get out at 2.20, which means I'll have a little extra time to get whatever I need done for the day. I made a to-do list on my phone yesterday or like last night. Don't mind where I'm putting the concealer right here. I've had this like tiny pimple here for the past like, I don't know, three days and it's really been getting on my nerves. Also, look how much I have left of this setting spray. Literally nothing. Anyways, I have a to-do list on my phone, but basically like overall what we got to do today is go to the nail salon because my nails are pretty grown out. Here's what they look like. And it's been, I think, four weeks since I got them done. So for me, that's the perfect time to get them done. I'm going to get a fill and then I'll show you guys what I end up doing for like a design. And then I also need to put all my Depop orders together. Tomorrow is the first even block day of the week. So it's periods two, four, six. And since I have a free six, that means I'll get out at lunch. So I'll have plenty of time to go ship those out. But anyways, I just need to get them all packaged later today after school. I also need to edit a sponsored video so that I can send that in for approval by tomorrow morning. And honestly, that should be it. I don't exactly remember, but I'm basically all ready for the day. This is our perfume choice today. It's the number eight one from the Urban Outfitters perfume. I've used like half of it already. I think I got this for Christmas. I really like this one. For hair, yesterday was not hair day and I had curled it in the morning and so there's just like little remnants. It is a little bit greasy on top. So I kind of was thinking of doing like two little braids today. So it is currently after school. It's 2 36 p.m I'm currently in the Starbucks parking lot because in a little bit I have my nail appointment I called for an appointment earlier for 3 p.m Because I thought the traffic would be worse after school, but I actually got out in like 15 minutes So it's currently 2 36 which means I have about 25 minutes until my actual appointment So I came and stopped by Starbucks Right, guys so I'm home it's currently 5:08 p.m. I took like a little 20 minute break for myself just because I went straight from school to the nail salon so I haven't had time to just like sit in my bed and relax so I took a little break I also made a TikTok go follow my TikTok if you want to here's the at but I made a TikTok took a little break and now it is time to grind out my Depop orders I think I have like 15 orders to pack some of them have multiple items in there I printed out all the shipping labels yesterday but that's all I've done I do want to say just thank you to everyone that's purchased from there obviously you guys do not have to and it helps me get rid of my clothes and I'm glad you guys are able to get some as well because a lot of it I truly do not wear so thank you guys so much for purchasing if you guys want to go check it out I will put the link in my description down below
Okay, so I had to take a brief break to eat some dinner. My mom made some pot stickers, which are my absolute favorite. But I also printed out these little, like, basically just thank you cards. Obviously, I appreciate all of your guys' purchases, so I like to put little thank you notes in all of my orders. And in the past, I've handwritten all of them. But with the amount of orders that I have, I just found that it would be easier if I just printed out the note and then signed all of them so that they're still, like, personalized, if that makes sense. So I went ahead and printed a bunch and then hand signed every single one so that I can include them in all my orders and then I'll put them in these little pouches because I just think they're adorable and you guys can literally use these for anything. Good morning. It is currently 8 12 in the morning on Friday, March 15th. I'm not gonna lie I kind of forgot I was filming this video on like Tuesday of this week I kind of had a lot going on the past few days So I haven't vlogged but I also forgot I was filming but today is Friday and I remembered I was filming this video So I decided to pick the camera back up. I'm at school right now I'm in the parking lot. It's a little bit before I need to go like into my actual school for the day today I have a full day. I have all three block periods first period math, which we're doing state testing the second period of the day Which is technically my third period is yearbook and fifth period which is the third period of the day is AP Lang. I actually hate filming in this parking lot because there's people just like walking everywhere but that's my day today. I'll be here till like 3 30 but the traffic will probably keep me here till like 3 45 but after school me and the girls have a fun little like chill evening planned with each other. So that's later today. I'll take you guys along with me for that. I don't think I'll bring you guys like in school just because I have to like focus on what I'm doing in school. Hi guys so I'm gonna be so real with you. The last Last time I picked up the camera to film in this weekly vlog was like a week ago. Today is Sunday, March 24th. So literally like over a week ago on a Friday, not the Friday that just happened like two days ago, like one that happened like nine days ago. I had told you guys that I was going to finish the vlog that day and I was gonna go like hang out with my friends and do all this fun stuff. I honestly don't know what happened, but that day was just like not a good day at all. I don't wanna go into like a ton of detail or anything, but basically like I was just crying the whole day and I'm not sure why but it was just not like a good day for like my mental health so i did not end up filming and i haven't filmed in over the past week because this past week was probably the most busy week i've had in a while for school but today like i said is sunday and i decided to pick up this vlog once again so that i can get it finished for you guys and so i can get it uploaded honestly today i'm just gonna be doing a little bit of like cleanup and like productivity my room's a little bit messy and so i need to clean that up and then i do have some stuff to do for like school a little bit of like work to do so so I figured I would finish off this little weekly vlog with a little like productive segment. I want to show you guys like a tiny little haul of things that I've gotten recently because why not? First off, I got this new phone case. It literally came in the mail yesterday, but I ordered it like 10 days to like two weeks ago. It is so cute. It's from SDH Paints. It's like a little collage case. I don't know. I feel like it's so cute. And then me and my sister went to Barnes & Noble yesterday. I'm not going to spoil what we're doing for spring break yet, but I wanted to have a book to read while I'm like tanning. So I got two new books. I think I'm gonna bring this one on the cruise, but this book is People We Meet on Vacation by Emily Henry. I read like two or three of her books over the summer and I absolutely loved them. I heard this one was good. And then I've seen a lot of good like reviews about this book. I'm usually the type to read like fiction, nonfiction type books. This one is actually a memoir and it's called Everything I Know About Love. I've seen so many like good TikToks and like just reviews about this book.
Hi guys, so I am popping in really quick for this video. I was gonna end it at the last clip, but I went to go deliver some Depop packages today. I got two boxes in my PO box, so I figured I would do just a little haul. I honestly do not know like what these packages are. I'd assume they're PR, but I'm not sure from where, so we're gonna do an unboxing. 